Today we're talking about the top 10 project management qualifications. And because sometimes the word qualifications can be a little bit ambiguous, I want to start with that to define what a qualification really is. So qualification is a quality or an accomplishment that makes someone suitable for a particular job. You may see some job boards that where they announce that the person needs to be able to communicate, maybe they need three years of experience, maybe have formal project management training, and be a certified project management professional. So when I talk to people, what they're really asking is, when they see a job board, they want to know, how can I qualify? So here's how I answer that. It really depends. So what does it depend on? So the qualifications for a project management position in a corporation are going to differ than those maybe for a nonprofit organization or even a startup organization. So I call it a blueprint. I think the blueprint is made of the skills, the training, the experience, and the certifications. So let's take a look at what's encompassed in these areas. So first of all, in the skills, there are three skill areas. The hardcore project management skills where the project manager needs to be able to define a schedule, they need to be able to budget the cost and measure the expenses against that. They need to be able to track and define the scope. They also need to be aware of uh, the quality expectations in certain industries. They also are required to now, more than ever, know the business skills, understanding financials or profit and loss statement, and again, being able to create a budget and track against it. And then now, the leadership skills, and I think this is where uh, companies really look for these skill areas. So being able to resolve conflict, being able to communicate, write, speak, negotiate, persuade, and also lead the teams. And then we look at training, and when we talk about training, companies typically look for a certain number of hours of training they're looking for. And typically in a corporation, they're looking for formal training. But there are also informal training that maybe you received from a group, organization, or even an association you belong to. They also look at the number of years of experience. Uh, some, if you're coming into an entry-level job, they may just want to know that you've had experience maybe as a volunteer, an intern, a co-op, or some other entry-level job. And then for the advanced level, they may be looking for maybe two to three years of experience as a project manager. And then uh, more importantly and more, uh, more popularly, you see the certifications. Companies now are looking for their project managers to have certain certifications. They typically want them to have a project management certification, which means a number, certain number of hours of training. And then also the PMP certification by PMI, the Project Management Institute. And to be uh, even qualified for that exam, you have to have so many number of hours of training and also a certain number of years of experience. And then more commonly, you'll also see a BA, a business analyst. Companies want their project managers to understand the business analyst. And then also certain industries you may also see certification requirements in Agile and Scrum. So as you can see, this is a blueprint, and you can see how it depends. And the red ones are typical, the top 10 in corporations. So if you need a tool that can help you with your project management skills and qualifications, then sign up for our software now at projectmanager.com.